you ready to go for a driving tour with us? We are off. We are pulled over to put our contraptions on. Our ET camera. Our ET contraptions. But today we're taking you on a driving tour of a part of Monument. We actually just discovered it. It's um, awesome. They just started building it. There's actually a home that's under contract, which I love. But it is $1.2 I feel like we should have the song. Crimson and clover. I don't think I know that song. I don't know oh. if it's the way that you're singing it or. It's probably. <laughs> It's like a 70s song, I think. But we're up at Monument. A lot of our clients zone into Northern Colorado Springs, Monument for a variety of reasons. Um, this is a new development by one, a, a builder who they do build throughout Colorado Springs and Denver. Um, we had had clients contract with them, but these but new this product models, line is not what I've seen in any of their other locations. It's like yesterday I called Richmond because we had a client reach out and um, they were, they're like, oh, this is a new model series. It's the 4300 series. And I'm like, okay. So she sent over the specs. It's like the exact same thing, but like the rooms are in different locations or something. It's not Now with that being said, exciting. they do have a new product line out east oh, too. Oh, you did talk about that it, one. It's kind of cool. But that that's what builders will come out with new product lines. And sometimes they can be the same floor plans, like what you're saying, tweaked a little. Or um, a different, like the ones that I'm thinking, like something like this, like totally yeah, different, RV like an RV garage. Um, or something that makes that collection stand out. And then within the collections, they'll even have different series of it. So what that means is different elevations, like the look of the house or the is this um, trim package or, oh, I need to go up yeah. more. But real quick while we're here, I don't know if you can see, we'll get back to the houses in a second because we're really excited about them. But yes. this is the high school. Is it Lewis Palmer? Um, yes. Lewis, because there's also a Palmer Ridge, which is yes. north of here. They're the bears. They're blue and yellow. This They're real is close the to each other. Orange and black. Lewis but look Palmer. up the reviews. Great reviews. This is a YMCA medical um, campus right to the closer to the highway. To the right, your left, our right. And then, you know, we talk about Forest Lakes. Forest Lakes is close to here, closer to the mountains. The downtown monument area is, what do you say, a couple? Maybe five minutes. Five minutes. Cute little downtown. They have small. a cute little donut shop, cafes, Not Mexican really. food. Yeah. And, and then there's that the lake that we brought you to a few times if you watch our videos is close. Maybe like 10 minutes from here as well. Um, so just as we drive into the community, I wanted to kind of show you what that lifestyle looks like in this area. It's definitely monument is definitely your small town feel. Yeah, you're so, right by the highway. It's and it's like a very Colorado highway. feel as well. Like you get mountains, you get trees, you have like, what, three grocery stores total yeah. um, scattered throughout High here. Peak Brewing is here. I went there this weekend. And There's was, a brewery. Uh, it has a beautiful patio. It's by a car wash. It's kind of weird that way, but you can see the foothills. Um, but, but it's like a few not yeah. like a handful of different options there's a few of each of those options i will say if you're thinking of moving to monument or you know you're thinking of moving to the area watch our monument uh, neighborhood tour because i th what i think is interesting about monument and colorado springs i can say the same but monument has so many different styles of homes mm. i always say like you have forest lakes and you have woodmore which is like wooded um there is an hoa but it's like different All older homes, homes older kinda. homes you have Kings which is more on two acres, open lots. Um, and then you have Sanctuary now Point. And Monument's getting Jackson a lot Creek. more of these more, af I'm going to call them affordable, but they're really seven, eight hundred thousand yeah. dollars dollars homes, but they're newer. Like mm -hmm. Monument kind of missed that. There was only Forest Lakes. And what else would have been a newer um, Sanctuary Point? Mm -hmm. But now... Like they, there's a couple other options yeah. so, around here, and this is one of our favorite new ones. So it says from the high 600s, but that's a lie. Mm -mm. It's not 600. From the low 800s, I would say. Oh, and look, they're um, right in front of us. I know, and I, to me, like if I brought my husband here, because I was, like I said, I always say find different places, and I'm like, when our next house, this is where we're gonna live. So he's always like, Lori, where are we, where are we gonna live next? But I don't think he would fall in love with like with this setting so much. But the house. Once you get the in there, and you can find the house with a view, and it's a great area, great schools, great resale. I would say good um, location to I twenty five. But Kaylee and I, see it's a, really about the views, though. I think here the views and the style of and house. the style of house. Because Kaylee and I see a lot of houses, and they kind of all look they have the same feel here in Colorado. Um, I mean, we see hundreds of homes. 
mm-hmm. every every week, <laughs> <laughs> which is great. We have a really good pulse on our area and our in our real estate market. Um, but when we walk into a new home, I like we walked in this home and we're like, it's like kids in a candy shop. Like it's like what you gets literally us going. had your dad pick up your daughter. I did. I like dad like, go bring my daughter need to a PT. little bit more time. I think it was a week ago because she has physical therapy again. But I was like, go pick her up. I have to see this house. Yep. So we are back here. We're gonna sh- take you on a tour. Of, Full vlog tour. Um, a couple of these. So yeah, I'm hoping you can see the mountains straight ahead. I'm gonna try to get some shots as we get out of the car as well, so you can see what that looks like. Do you want um, me to drive right a yeah, little? Yeah, just drive right so they can see. I think, you know, it depends upon, like, in a lot of neighborhoods, how the house is situated and if it sits along these ridges that are but elevated. But the exterior, it reminds me of, like, something in the mountains, like a Silverton mm-hmm. or, a, um, like, up in Granby or Crested Butte. Like, the style of houses yeah. is a little bit different. The, the finishes they're putting on the interior are amazing as well. So it's a smaller community. So this is one of the roads. It dead ends up here at a cul-de-sac. Um, we need to talk to the builder and that's what we're hoping to do today to see, are they releasing all the lots? Are they gonna do this in phases? But I'm hoping when I turn around here, like all of these homes on this mm-hmm. ridge have views yeah. <laughs> and of like, the mountains. And it's not a custom build. You're building with a, a, a builder, but- Oh, the black windows. The black windows. We like the black windows. And I would say there's going to be people in this little cluster that are going to have a similar house, but not a lot. And Mm-mm. so um, your home is going to be more unique. Um, like we were showing homes this weekend in Sanctuary Point, and that same model is built in like four different neighborhoods. You're it's like, like oh, okay, well, I mean, it's a beautiful I can home. go to Flying Horse and get it for 100000 less than if I were to build the and, same one at Monument. Yes, exactly. And so, yeah. but these are real unique. And so I th- we haven't even seen them all yet. So we're going to try to find a new one. We're going to go... Um, See if we can break in here and get you guys some more detailed information on this one and then stay tuned to the end Oh, you're gonna. Oh, yeah, that's pretty. Um, We're gonna show you One of my favorite parts about this community. Okay, so we're at one of the models here as you can see construction going on which is gonna happen a new community The way it's spread out. I don't think it would affect you for that long If that's a concern, but Kayleen had to go to the bathroom what I love about Kayleen. She goes to the bathroom in the port of potty That was a when nice clean at a model, though. Why wouldn't you just go in the model home where it's like a beautiful bathroom? Because sometimes they let you go in there and sometimes not. They always let you go to the bathroom. They're never going to tell you you can't go to the bathroom. When you're... Anyways. <laughs> Kayleen always has to go to the bathroom. And she always goes in port of potties Are you them. showing them this view? Yes. Like, to me, this is like... And it's peaceful up on the hill. You can see the Air Force Academy. Can you see Garden of the Gods? I don't see the red rocks. I think and it's so that. funny because it's a different view because that mountaintop oh, yeah. popping out is the tip of Pikes Peak, but mm. it's like these mountains right here with the red yeah. dirt. And we'll walk you down the street so you can see a little bit of what I talked about with some of these homes with views, but we're gonna go in and see if we can get into some of these models here to show you the inside. Oh yeah, before we go downstairs, you have to check out this laundry room. This I mean, was one of Usually my... we don't get very excited about laundry, but look at how big their laundry rooms are. They oh, have, look at they have like little snowboards and that makes it look fun. So we have some details now. We can tell you a little more about these. Mm. So this is a here's your your guest room. Yeah. Look how cute. I know. And I do think like when people do these rooms, this is like because I'm doing that new build, but to do hand me back up. All right, I'm back. So it makes such a big difference. Like this is just batten board, a wood piece. Um What's that called? It's Filled just a, a one by four. And look at the difference it makes for that wall. It's, it's just one by that. two. All right, so, and it also has an attached bathroom with full tiling. So this one that we're looking at is 1.35 million. But that's but all of the landscaping. And $100,000 upgraded landscaping. Yes. You can do this floor plan. Here, starting price here. point is what you say, 920. 920, 920. somewhere low to mid 90s. But then I think it's so unique because you still have a really nice dining area mm-hmm. and windows all the way around. I know. A lot of natural light. Good size deck. Good size and deck. Patio. A couple of other ones had smaller ones, but I think this is a good size covered deck with those views. And I was talking to her. And so finally one, those ones right, right here are going to have good views as well. Some ranch plans. And it's going to continue that way. And then over on this side, sorry, there's I'll some your way. inventory homes, some dirt start options as well. But 
filing one is going to continue and then it's going to keep going for filing two and all these lots should have some decent views. Um, but good, I like how this is kind of set. You can, I, I can picture furniture in here. Uh -huh. That fireplace is modern, floor to ceiling, tile. Those accent walls aren't a part of it, but you could easily and do that. And the lighting throughout, like it's kind of nice to see, like you have square brass, you have round black, almost like another, I mean, it's black and round, but kind of more of an industrial or even mid-century. Yeah, I like that. Look. Let's check out Master. I would never pick these gold pieces, but I like how it pulls in the warm tones into here. Look how cute. Oh, even this headboard. See, I'm always like, what do you do for headboards for beds? But in, in such a tall In such a tall room. thing. I'm like, I'm trying to figure out if that's just a and piece And Lori, look at the together. lamps with those gold pieces. I know. I know that that's not part of the house, but it sure is cute. <laughs> this is why we get a little off track and a little excited, but good size master oh. and trade ceilings with that wooden accent, which adds. Guess what type of tile again? Oh, it's, what do you call it? I never Zalige. can remember. Zalige. Bathroom. Yeah, they did the full Zalige. Shower is huge. I love the Zalige tile. I know. I do too. It's just, it's. Like, I, I'm going to call it like a modern subway because we're seeing it everywhere now. Mm -hmm. And then you have look at this. the same cabinetry. They tiled into the closet, which is nice. Oh, look at the nice big mirror here. You can see what I meant. And then his, his and hers. <laughs> and hers, yep. Yeah. It, it, to be honest, it's about the right size. Yeah, I like it. Not too big, not too small. I love the tall doors. Yep, with that. Throughout, and it's panel. throughout the whole main. And the views in this place I like, can't even are tell amazing. You. I don't know if you can see that. Like every room has a view on some of these lots here in Monument. All right, we're in the model. This is what I love. Well, the windows is the second piece of what I love. I know this is a model, but that's like a navy color. Usually they just have like whites or no built-ins. Mm -hmm. Kind of like an office. I don't mm -hmm. know about the, the glass doors. This, this would, be would be garage. Garage. So we'll just count that as garage. But they have the tall doors look at the view i mean those i gotta go closer see but oh look at the laundry it. room oh we have to come back all right this is a good size deck the other ones we didn't have as good a size of a deck i like a good deck but check that out and that's like a park so no one will be there it's our favorite kitchen lori is it oh yeah i do like it's this our, kitchen this is your house this is my house i'm gonna buy this one <laughs> Oh, look Win at the backsplash, Lori. I know. I do love that. It's like that teal. Vertical. Almost. It's just different. And this is the, the leathered, dark like countertop. And I actually like the counter or the cabinets, that natural wood. Oh, and look at this. A griddle. A griddle. I can, my husband and a can six cook burner. me some crepes. And I like mm. the gold knobs. And then See, this, and is, this is our favorite part. This is our extended pantry. And I would have it all cute like this, too. And then I would store... All my random stuff How down do there. How do they keep the brown sugar from hardening? You put like bread in it, I think. <laughs> so before we go downstairs, I know this is silly, but you have to take a look at the laundry room. I know. We don't really like to do laundry, but if you're going to have to do laundry, you might as well do it here. So they have not only this coat area, two coat closets, a folding table, and then another area to do look at all that ski more stuff. built-ins. I mean, like to me... Why does every builder not do this? I know, I love a good drop zone. I know. All right, let's check out the downstairs. And you still had the powder, too. And I love coming to these ones, too, to see how they stage it. Like, what do you do with a big wall? I kind of have something like this in mind. Do you have it, like, stacked down? But they just go straight across with the um, pictures that fill the wall. Oh, this is fun down here. <laughs> it feels like an actual game area. And look at that U-shaped sectional. Oh, my gosh, it's huge and beautiful and I just love the accent walls I can't stop thinking about accent walls <laughs> I have a problem with them and who would have thought to do like the stripes you literally have sure how a game exactly. table a pool table and a lounge area mm -hmm. and this is pretty much like a full kitchen down oh. here and look at this huge this view. slider windows throughout the whole downstairs this view and then Landscaping is included on these ones, not that level, but I mean, that's $100,000 of landscaping for that outdoor living with that view. But you can choose the AstroTurf, the low maintenance living, or you can choose to upgrade to 
facade or vice versa. And then you have more bedrooms down here too. Yeah, so there's just mechanical room, a couple closets, but then this is the other oh, bedroom so spaces. Cute. Look at how cute this room. Whoever their interior look at, designer look is, at it's an A plus. I know, I like that color. This is fun. <laughs> and then bathroom. Bathroom. Did but they, they do put, accent tile there? I mean, just a little bit. Like they do different, that's like gray on the side and then white or blue. This is a big room. This is so a David This is not decorated as cute, but no. it is very nice to see. They're yeah. showing you what's behind oh, yeah. the walls, what kind of insulation, house wrap is used. They're talking about their Energy. electrical. Yeah. Um, actually, really good information so this me. is one for um 920 you can start this one's 1.35 obviously some upgrades to this one great views lot premium but we're going to show you guys a more affordable yes. out here as well like mid 800s so yeah. we're going to go next door we're going to show you again the pretty model but you can be out here in cloverleaf in the 800 and the couple that are inventory homes that we have seen i mean i know you can always do a dirt start at eight and then always like you always tend to go up in price but yeah. i would say the ones we've seen have some good finishes in them. Fantastic. Yeah. Yeah. All right, we're off to the next one. So I again, these one. Is this the Greenhorn? Greenhorn. Now I do know she said these ones on the ridge are the premium lots. The ones that phase two down below, they're like mid grade, but you still get amazing views from them. Right. This is the mid eights option, I and it's cute too. I I actually like this is that floor plan this Lori. is that floor plan is it the deck that I wanted bigger something so this was the area they finished this out to show you what you can do with it but it can be office TV you could do like look how they one. did this though to show you how you could use it they've done just the leaves in a different color and they do look at that pop like the penny the penny yeah. on the top of it uh-huh never thought of that one and then, oh, you're gonna like this accent wall. Oh, I do. Ooh, see, I'm getting some good ideas. I do like that. Is that like a natural wood that's stained? Or they yeah, they stained a pine or a redwood or something. I'm gonna look at that. Hmm, interesting. I'm taking a picture. Oh, I'm taking a picture. See, this is our, our drug of choice for nice home. And then this one, oh, I do like this one too. This, it's fun to see this stage. So no mm -hmm. fireplace in this one, but you could put yeah. one there. So and then see. they do have my accent wall again in here. Nice windows. This one is a good view. Full landscaping. And the mountains actually appear closer than that. And then uh, look at this kitchen. I like it open. Is this one for sale yet? No, I want this one. I'm changing my mind. I don't know. Because it's not on sale. Sorry. That one on sale was it right here. You need on the list for Yeah, I'll be on the list because I don't want to move for like three years. Okay. That's probably about when you would be looking Perfect. How much is how much is this one? Like this one is like one point one. One point one. Like with the upgrades that you could start at like eight. Yes. To me though, this feels like at that point you're you have kids out of the house. Yeah, want I want this house. I'm gonna buy this house. Yeah, the other one is big. It yeah, because I don't need that. I don't want that big a house like right. I, for that. But I want room in yeah. case my children like yeah, decide they still like, like me so and come back and visit me. Yeah. Yeah. Are you selling a lot of this floor plan? Um, oh, and see the other one is just kind room. of different. Yeah. Yeah, it was more to the side. Yeah. This is so a different is model than we saw. No. This is because there's different right. models. Yeah, yeah you're not on. Yeah, you're not on. I did. I took it off. Sorry. Okay. So this, though, was different in that last one we saw. Yeah. So this is an option. This is a whole different layout. This is a so different So you model. can choose this if you do a dirt start. This model. This model, yeah. The one you're thinking of we saw was a totally different model. It was? Oh, yeah, because, because you had the stairs going down. And the yeah. kitchen was on the side. You're that right. One. That's why I was confused. I kind of like I this. Thinking. I like this angled look of this. This would be uh -huh. neat, too. To me, it's still like you can serve a lot, like have yeah. a walk through. Yeah. Master. Oh, yeah. Views, accent walls. Walk 
took a, if you put like a little window on the top to let in some more natural light. And then in here, good size master, gold accents, shower. Then the detail, they have vertical and horizontal tile. Love that. To the ceiling. And then master. Kaylee's still talking about the decor. And, oh yeah, turn your mic back on. Okay, that's upstairs. Do we miss anything up here? No, I don't think um, we did. You is this saw a two-car garage then? This is a three. Oh, it's a three? Yeah, this oh, one is a three. And then you have that open railing down. Oh, here's laundry. Oh, good. Yeah. Still good size for laundry, and it feeds off garage. You have a little drop zone, which I love. And we have epoxy. Obviously, this is being used as a model. Hey, sir, how are you? Oh, three-car garage. That, I do love the laundry rooms yeah. in these. Even yeah, we still talk about the laundry. Really, really we were out. saying we love the laundry rooms in these ones. And I usually don't really care for laundry, but. Yeah. All right, let's go down. Here's your wood on the walls, too. I know. Yep. Every wall has an accent. Which is I know, I feel like I need to doll up my house. Oh, and then look at, there's like a brick layout. This is my house. Oh my gosh, look at those pictures on the wall, Lori. <laughs> those are amazing. Oh, and look at that accent oh. on the back of that thing. That's like, it's a true like wet bar with an island. Yep. And I like the size of this basement. It's not huge. Right. But it's you still big feel like enough. you can like furnish it. Yeah. Is this mechanical? Nope, that's just a nice cooking closet. Oh. Is the and wine then, fridge included? Oh my gosh, where did you get those pictures no, from? I need those have. too. <laughs> Wait, who's your, where'd you get those pictures from? You can't do they all have that a, information? They have an interior, yeah, we have an interior design firm that we use in-house, um, so I'd have to reach out. I that bet is, they're an I need that for my, or something. Um, my Granby house. Do your, um, do your Google on your phone. Your, your, um, if you've got Google, you can hit the um, Sign camera, button? and then it'll find them. Oh, I had to go do that. What? So but what did we learn today, Kayleen, about the Google app? Um, she you can, she you can life. search photos. Yes, and yeah. I just found out where to get those. Etsy. Etsy. Love those. Yep. All right, continuing on. <laughs> <laughs> We're back in the car. My it's hair is a little windy. My hair is a little windy, and I got a little excited about the house. I did tell her to put my name on that list for that one when it comes available. I think it's amazing size. So I, all right, people say that all the time. With that being said, they'll say, can I just buy the model? And different builders handle selling their models at different times. So this particular builder is waiting till the end. They're creating an interest list. Some builders mm -hmm. sell it right away, but they'll lease it back from the owners for X amount of years. So it mm -hmm. kind of depends. But, but they're yeah. only in filing once. This will be built out for a while. So I'm going to have to wait a while, which is wait. fine. It'll probably, I'll probably be outpriced by the time it's done. Uh, but I like a lot of aspects of that. But this is the first filing. So I just wanted to show you, kind of finish up the video here. I will say we have exclusive. No, this is the second filing, right? She, this is first for a little bit, and then the second, she said, will start like around Over the here. ridge a little bit here, around the bend. Okay. Um, but I do say that, or I will say, and I do say, that we have exclusive access to direct contact to some of these new build reps. You Literally save in our contacts. no money by going directly to a builder. You get us in your back pocket to like be boots on the ground. We've caught negotiate. like. Negotiate? We, well, negotiate. We can negotiate price. We negotiated like 50, 60,000 terms this last weekend for people. Um, terms, um, earnest money, you always want to make sure that's protected. Can you get that back? There's a lot of variables that go into this and you get access to our big green box. In fact, our people that are closing on Friday, Intensive. they were in town and they knew, I'll never forget when you called me that day, they knew that they were building with a certain builder. Oh yeah. They, and then they're like, wait, we forgot to call our realtor. So Lori called and she yep. said, Kayleen, we have a client who's in town. They're looking at these houses. They're going to build with the builder. All we have to do is show up, but then we have to take it from there. We have to help them contract. We need to see if we can negotiate. And then we have to be their boots on ground because they were mm -hmm. living out of state. So and that's then what during we did. walk through, there was like, like a couple, it was a good builder. Don't get me wrong, but there was like holes in the wall. They're worried about lopsided um, trim they, work. They changed paint a couple times yeah. because of the, it was like too bright and so we could film it for them and show them and they got our incentive which saved them even more money um so anyways reach out to us this and we and maybe what also happens is 
Did you tell them how many lots are in this development? I don't know. There's only 131. Oh, okay. Three phases total. They're ending phase one, starting phase two. So these it's going to go pretty quick. Yeah, too. these this are pretty. Kind of and this is like kind of open space behind. Yeah, I like these too. And it's cold as heck. I know. I like this as well. Um, we went on the list for this phase. <laughs> so make sure you reach out to us. This is just a view of Cloverleaf. And sometimes our clients know they want a new build or they're kind of going between existing and new builds and we can help you maneuver all of that and this might not be the right builder for you this might not be the right location for you so we know our different areas and what each area presents like the one you're talking about had those rv garages mm -hmm. which if you want that or one want in the 600 plan community with like the pools so there's a lot of different options here in colorado springs and monument so make sure you put those numbers into your phone and reach out to us um, but for now we are out from beautiful colorado Thank you.